Hi and welcome to an extra tutorial extra tutorial in my Django for Beginners series. Um, in my last tutorial I showed you very quickly how to set up a Django server and get the whole thing up and running very quickly. Django by default comes with a or uses a SQLite database. In this tutorial I'll be showing you how to get your project to point to a Postgres database. Now I have two terminal windows open here. Uh, on the right I have a Postgres terminal and on the left I am within my my project folder of my Django project. On the right if I look in my Postgres you can see my, my list of databases here is I have Postgres and my two template databases. And you can see I have no relations found, which is no tables. And if I look inside my Django project folder, I have my my project folder. If I navigate to this, and then I look inside my settings file, these apps here are the ones that will require database access. If I scroll down to database settings here, you'll see database settings. Now what I want to do is actually I want to change these here. So for now if I just totally remove what you see and I then insert what I think I've typed already, I'll put this in the comments. Now the database name is everything I have with my Postgres connection is default. So my database name by default is Postgres. My database user by default is Postgres and my default password so I never forget for demo is password my host is localhost and the port is the default port for Postgres which is 5432 So now when I execute my manage and migrate, the tables, the, the applications that require database access will now use my Postgres database. So if I check here my Postgres, you will see my Django project has created these tables within my Postgres database and from this point forward it will use my Postgres. And there you go, that's just a very quick tutorial of how to get your Django project to point to your Postgres database. Thank you very much.